Yo, stay focused, man's on a mission Wavy like the ocean, ain't got time for inhibition Eyes on a prize, lock it in your vision Straight up, man, let's gotta make a decision Stay focused, man, I gotta go Can't be going backwards, I can't be going slow Gotta take the lead and I gotta steal the show What's going on YouTube, how y'all doing? I hope y'all are doing awesome Today I'm back with another Sea of Survival video. We've been working on the Seas of Survival. I did a list, you know, I'll put a link at the end or somewhere, somewhere I'll do, you know, or you can go back and look. I'll have it on my playlist. So, many people have their Seas of Survival. A lot of the preppers say, you know, the, the five Seas of Survival or the ten Seas of Survival or twelve or however many. I added a few of my own personal just because well, I can, and so, and I'm just kind of doing videos to cover each one a little bit more in depth. I went over the whole list, just kind of touched on everything, but now I'm kind of going through and, you know, going more, a little bit more in depth on each particular Sea of Survival, and today's is a little bit, it's a little bit different, or it's not different, it's one that a lot of people miss. Some of you get it, but or many of you get it on yours, but some of you don't, and it's conditioning. So we're going to talk about conditioning. Hey, y'all. Sorry to interrupt the show, but I just wanted to just come on real quick and and thank y'all for watching. And if you haven't already and you, and you feel obliged, why don't you go down and do the YouTube stuff real quick. Take a couple seconds and smash that subscribe button or just tap it or just hit it or caress it or whatever you gotta do just hit that subscribe button according to my analytics only 10 percent of you are actually subscribed and so i mean do me a favor and hit that subscribe button hit the you know and if you want to support the show and financially a little bit if you're inclined no pressure but there is that super thanks button if you if you feel like it there's also memberships if you want to join don't quite have any members yet, but, you know, we'll get there. But anyway, just hit that subscribe button and give the video a thumbs up and, you know, do this stuff. Appreciate y'all. I love you. I wouldn't be doing this without you. All right. Now, back to the show. Now, conditioning. You know, conditioning is not just going to the gym and working out. You know, it is. You know, go to the gym, work out, get your exercise routine. Put your rucksack on or bug out bag or whatever. Put a bag on and, and go walking. Go, you know, condition. Because, you know, you you don't rise to the level of expectation. You fall to your highest level of training. So if, if you know, whenever the SHT happens, whatever it is, whether it's natural disaster or man-made disaster or whatever, you have to, you know... you're going to rise to your highest level of training and of actual physical conditioning. If you don't go out and do it, you're you're not going to be able to when the time comes. And there's more there's there's a little bit more to it than than just physical conditioning. There's also mental conditioning. You know, like part of another couple of my C's that kind of go along with this is calm. You gotta stay calm. You gotta train. You you know you've gotta pr prepare and you've gotta ha get that mindset conditioning. You know for when when it does happen, you're not panicking. Everybody's not panicking, and also control. That's another one that kind of goes another C of survival that goes along with conditioning is control. You gotta stay in control. You gotta be in. You know you can't panic. You, you, those are that that the you're in charge of whether it's wife, kids, parents, you know whatever. You've got to be in control. You've got to make sure they stay calm and don't panic because, you know, it's going to be, it's going to be scary. It's going to be rough. It's going to, you know, and depending on your level of training, conditioning, you've got to be able to control that, the situation and you've got to be able to stay calm. So that's a lot of conditioning, planning, you know, physically, mentally 
you know, you've got to have the right mindset, the right skill set to to handle the situation. So conditioning, and that is, like I said, it is, you know, go to the gym, get an ex exercise routine. If you can't do that, like I said, just put your put your backpack on and go 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 for a walk. Go walk a couple miles. Walk, you know, however far you want to walk. You know, start. Start small if you if you can't do it, just start small. Just go walking. You don't even have to go rucking. You just go walk, and then start putting on a backpack and go and you know, and just start doing. Start making your plans. Start you know, go out do do some actual you know simulations of. What SHTF is going to look like? Walk to your to your bug out location, or or whatever, or drive to it, or you know, just so you know, okay, this is where we're going. This is how we're going to do it. You know, have simulations. You know, you know, have you know the kids if they go to school, have them, you know, practice. You know, for whatever if something happens and they have to have to leave and can't communicate with you, have, you know, practice your meeting spot, practice your fire drills at the house, practice, you know, you train it, practice it, conditioning. It's, it's, it's not just a physical be tough, be strong. Let's, you know, it's a lot of that, but it's also firearms training. It's, you know, medical training. It's, you know, if something happens, do you have the, the mental capacity to, Bandage a wound if you get shot or if something happens, you, you know, do you have not, it's not only having the supplies, it's also having the skill set. Can you do that? Can you, you know, can you plant food? You know, if it's a bug in location, bug in, if you're staying at home, can you plant food? Can you do, you know, it's all a matter of conditioning, both mentally and physically. But so that's why I put conditioning on there. Many of you have conditioning, but I don't know, you know, as far as your level of conditioning on your list of as far as like, yeah, we got to go out and ruck. We got to go train. We got to, but it's also a lot of mental. And I, I think a, that's where a lot of, a lot of you, a lot of preppers, they miss on conditioning. It's, it's more than just physical. You know, conditioning is also planning and training and, you know, even the small stuff. Even the stuff that doesn't take any phys physical ability at all. It's all in your head. Can you figure out, you know, can you read a map? Can you, you know, stuff like that. It's all conditioning. It's all, you know, mentally conditioning. Condition your brain. Condition your, your body. But anyway... That's conditioning. That's all I got for, for this one. You know, if there's anything else you, you can think of, leave it in the comments. Conditioning, if you've got, if that's on your list or not on your list, or if I'm dumb for putting it on my list, or if there's something I missed, let me know. Let, let us all know. Let, you know, help me help you, help you help me, you know, type of thing. Let's, let's help each other out. Let's, let's, let's do this. So, anyway. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment. You know the drill. You know the YouTube stuff. It costs you nothing and helps me out a lot. It takes you two seconds. Two seconds of your time. And helps me out a ton. I'm trying to get to, to that milestone of 5,000 subscribers. A couple hundred away at the moment. So I'm trying to get to that. I'm planning a nice little giveaway. Hopefully I need to figure out how to do that. But... I need to think of, I think I have a good idea what to give away, but here in a little bit, watch for that video. So, and at the time of the time this gets put on, I may already be at that milestone, but, but we, I don't know. I'm still a couple hundred away. So, but anyway, try to shoot for that milestone. Help me out. Help us all out. Let's get this done and appreciate y'all. Love you. I'll see you in the next one.